Hey everybody, it's Echo Julia, and today we are back in The Sims 4 doing the Tiny Town Challenge created by YouTuber Deligracy. Between episodes, I did go and try to find some more gems. I didn't find very many. I also decided to go ahead and sell the limestone fossils and the little plum bob people. And so I definitely got a pretty good amount of money from doing that. So since I have the money and then I have a few crystals here lined up, we're going to go ahead and cut all of them. And we're going to look into making some jewelry today to sell on the table that I have going on over here. So let's get Jim, Opal Jim, out of the... Oh, I never fixed her shoes. I meant to do that. I meant to fix her lack of shoes oh, while I was playing in between yeah. videos, but I'll just have to do it next time. So we're going to go ahead and get cutting some gemstones. Let's do something else since we do have quite a bit of money saved up. We'll do this brilliant cut gemstone and we will do the citrine. Sim will randomly find simoleons doing things around the house. We're going to keep this. We're going to keep this. We're going to turn this into jewelry. Oh, this is going to be for us yeah. because this is a essentially a rags to riches yeah. challenge. If you don't know what a rags to riches challenge is, it's basically yeah. you start off with zero simoleons and you do whatever you can to make all the simoleons. So a couple of things that happened during my in-between playing other than making all the money is she was starting to feel burnt out in the last episode I believe and I wasn't doing the right thing to fix it. Um, she ended up becoming burnt out but it, luckily it ended up going away after just going to sleep. So Miss Opal here finished this brilliant cut gemstone so I'm going to Put this in her inventory and see about making it into jewelry. Now we are going to keep this piece. Let's see. What do we want to make? I think I'm just going to go with these basic earrings here. It says no crystal slot and select a design. What am I missing? I have a crystal. Do I need to make a basic cut? No. What am I supposed to do? It's in her inventory, right? It is. Let's see. Oh, I can't make... I can't make jewelry with something already cut. Okay, so I guess we'll choose something else. We'll sell this one and just keep the cut crystal that I made. Sims fun needs does not decay. Tense mood lids will fade much faster. Uh, we'll do this romantic one. Maybe since that's the case, we'll do something a bit more strapped. Let's do this one. That looks pretty. And we'll do the social light. Okay. That's going to cost us 190 simoleons to create. I guess I'll go ahead and throw this on the charging map. Um, because we have some money saved up, I'm going to go ahead and buy, oh, see, here's, I didn't sell everything, I suppose. Yeah, so ha I had, I think, like, 20 of these fossils. See, like, every time I broke whoop up one of the limestones, oh, she's tense, so she's not going to do this. Oh, she's tense from nearby gemstone losing charge. Okay, that's annoying because that says it's drained and that says it's drained anywho like I was saying I'm going to go ahead and buy a dumpster to get rid of all of these gross plates everywhere because it is bringing her mood down sometimes so I'm just gonna go grab this dumpster here and see what color do we want I don't want any of the graffiti ones Maybe we'll go with red for now. Let's see. So will she not resume bling earrings? Okay, so she's going to do that, and then I'm going to throw away all of this garbage. Level 6, Gemology. Opal will get additional crystals and metals when digging at rocks, and can design mystical jewelry and cut star-shaped gemstones at the Gemology table. Oh, that's awesome. I would love to be able to find more gemstones and rocks and metals. So here we are crafting the jewelry. Looks like we got a little soldering tool. So we finished our first piece of jewelry. Beautiful. So I'm gonna put this in her inventory rather than, okay, just walk away from me. 
I put this in her inventory rather than putting it straight on the table because I want to get all of this sold. I want to get all of this sold before I start putting jewelry up along with it. So she is feeling a little sad due to low social, so I'm going to have her FaceTime a friend. We'll do Cyprus, one of the other townies. That actually got her mood up pretty well. Let's go ahead and have a quick meal. And then we'll go back to, I guess, designing jewelry instead of cutting the gems now that we know you can't use cut gems in jewelry. So design, should I do design random jewelry? I'm gonna do this. Since we have the money to do it, I'm going to have her, I don't understand. So I guess she's designing a mystic necklace. Oh, she, okay, so she, it looks like she might be using the materials already in her inventory, which is nice. Oh no, so it is raining. Maybe today we can work on building like a box for her to live in. I think we'll try to make that today's goal. Make a box with like, we'll say with like a bed, a door, and a window. So her mood is being affected because of the rain. Hopefully that won't mean that she'll fail making this jewelry because I really want to see what she decided to make and how it turns out. Ooh, so we finished this jewelry. How lovely. Mystical necklace. I love that. How pretty. Oh, it's botched. Oh no. Oh, what does it say? Oh no, you've botched the jewelry. Better try again. So is it worth nothing? Oh, it's still worth 322 simoleons. Okay. That's cool. So Bot's jewelry has no crystal to charge. So it looks like it's just, I guess, the metal. I don't know. We'll try to sell it. Let's go ahead and fertilize the bush. So it's 8 p.m. and it looks like our crystals are charging. I'm excited for this one. We're going to keep this around. Oh, I sh next time... I get one of these, I'll make it into a jewelry so we can wear it. Hopefully we can still find simoleons with it just being around us. So we're gonna take a quick break from crafting and we're going to clean this up. And this is already full from the little bit, I guess it wasn't a little bit, it was quite a lot of dirty dishes laying around. So we'll go ahead and get, I don't know, maybe diaper deals. I don't know why she glitched there. Oh, here's. Here's the garbage pile. Oh, I don't want to put it in my inventory. I just want to throw it away. Where are you going? Oh, there's so many more over here. Whoops. Okay, instead of throwing this away, she decided to just put it on the ground. Is it because, oh, it's probably because this is too full. Let's go ahead and dive for deals. See if we have any, see if we can find anything that we could use or maybe our future townies can use. Opal found tables are groovy. Okay. Let's see what kind of condition it's in. Looks like it's the burnt condition, so I guess we'll just leave it in the inventory for now. Decide what to do with it later. She decided she's going to take a shower. I guess she was stinky, probably. After diving into some dumpsters, I probably would be stinky too. Okay, let's dive for some more deals. What a cute outfit. Still no shoes. So orange dye in the dumpster. I wonder if that would be good for Cypress. Let's see, where is he stationed? Over here? No, and the aperture. Here we go, Cypress. Since he's going to be crafting and such, we'll put that there. Okay, let's dive for more deals, even though she just decided she was going to sleep. She's not that tired. Oh, a frog! Maybe we'll keep that as our pet. This can be our pet tiger frog. Oh yeah, it stopped raining. We have another table. It would be cool if we could restore these and maybe put it like in our community area. But we'll have to see. Looks like we found a love seat. Some recycled materials. Okay, so the area got cleaned up a little bit, so we'll grab this garbage, have her throw that away, and I believe she's stinky again, so we'll have her take a shower. Okay, instead of taking a shower, she decided to cook some food. 
I guess we have the money for that. I just wish we had. Maybe I should also purchase a refrigerator so that all this food we keep making doesn't go to waste. If you make the food, I expect you to eat the food. I know you're stinky. I tried- Okay. I tried to get you to take a shower earlier, but you decided to make food that you're not gonna eat now. But that's fine. That's fine. So now we're done with the shower, and now we're gonna eat the food. So we'll just have Opal go to sleep for the night, and then once we wake up in the morning, we'll be all nice and refreshed and ready to make good jewelry. Because that's what we're trying to do today. We're trying to make jewelry to sell the jewelry. It is now morning time. Our social is low, so let's do another video call. Let's do, let's do Beatrice. So we just finished talking with Beatrice, but it doesn't seem that that helped all the way with her social. So now we'll call Azure. How about we call Azure? Hey Azure, how's it going? You know, I'm just out here trying to get a good start on this little community, you know, that we all decided to work on together. Hope everything is going well for you, living in the house with all of our friends. Yeah, it rained on me yesterday, but it's fine now. It's a, it's a nice, pretty day. The sun is out, kind of. It's a little cloudy, but it's okay. Back to the pea bush. Since our stats are looking pretty fine, let's go ahead and stock this table. We're going to tend it, and we're going to try to sell what we have going on here. I think I only have everything on a 25% markup. Nothing too crazy because I did want to sell, but I wanted to get a little bit more money because we're just going to need so much more more money. We're going to need so much more simoleons. Start a yard sell. And the reason why I did like it in between session is because this game can get a little grindy, especially when you're first trying to start out. And I just didn't want it to be the same thing over and over again. Let's go, people. Okay, finally, we have somebody coming to buy our fossils. Hello, friend. Can we also talk a little? Can I say, can I give a sales pitch? Maybe this will bring up my social, too. Okay, I'm talking to them, but it doesn't seem to. Oh, look, he bought something. Oh, so did he. See, let me see. Market prices. Yeah, we're only on 25%, so hopefully this will go by nice and quick. Let's see what else is left in here. Yeah, just a few more pieces. Oh, okay, we're talking now. That social is a problem. Oh, Oh, sentiment gain. What kind of sentiment? Are we friends? Alan feels close to Opal from good times and happy memories. Oh, well, we have amazing compatibility. Oh, he has a spouse. Okay, never mind. Sorry. So we can do, like, some romance in here. Like, that's not off limits. But I'm not gonna... When we have to have a seven-sin household, it's not gonna be easy. It's not gonna be easy. Okay. I appreciate you talking with us, but nobody's buying anything, and I'm not worried it's because we need you. Let's give... Miss Lily Fang, a sales pitch. Hello, sir. Would you like to buy some fossils? Ooh, yes, both of them bought fossils. Okay, let's stop with our last item here. You can leave, sir. You've already bought your items. You can leave. Hello, let's give a sales pitch. Ziggy, what's up, my friend? Baku Jane and I were planning to spend some casual friend time together. Should I do it? Yeah, sure, why not? It's okay to have friends. Oh, we finished. Perfect. Okay, so let's go ahead and make some more jewelry. Let's not make random. No, I said jewelry. Let's not make random jewelry because it looks like it kind of picked like the highest type of design that we could do and the higher the design type the more likely we're going to fail so let's get something different let's do this delicate bracelet that looks cute so we just finished our bracelet and it's excellent quality yay let's 
go ahead and put this in our inventory to sell. And I guess I can go ahead, I want to put it on this table and then stock the table so I can see what everything looks like. So let's stock the table. <laughs> oh, this looks like it can hold so many items. Let's make some more design jewelry. Do a diamond. Let's do diamond earrings like this. And we'll use Romantheon. She's feeling very focused. Aspiration Ascendance. Every want fulfilled and aspiration <laughs> satisfied rewards vocal twice as much because of this nearby, this quartz here. And this says Opal is finding simoleons in unlikely places, which is from the cit citrine. Uh, this emerald right here isn't going to do much for me, so I think I'm going to actually go ahead and put it on the selling table and try to sell that. Level 7 Gemology. Opal now crafts jewelry and gemstones even faster and can design botanical jewelry and cut skull shaped gemstones at the gemology table. How fun! Yes. We're almost done with this. Oh, look at that. <gasps> How pretty. These are gorgeous. Let's go ahead and put that in her inventory. It looks like we're still doing good on our needs, so we're going to go ahead and design more jewelry. This is our last crystal. And what was this at? Sims Fun Need Does Not Decay. You know what we haven't done? A bracelet yet but this is the new botanical we're gonna hold off on that we'll do this eye bracelet instead and we'll use we'll use the death metal here's our eye bracelet lovely we're gonna go ahead and put that in her inventory as well she's looking a bit hungry so let's have her have a quick meal we'll put these items on the selling table And because I don't have any more gems, we're going to go ahead, once it's morning, we're going to start selling what we do have. Let me just get her needs up and ready, and then we'll pick it back up. Okay, we have our table fully stocked with all of our items. Let's go ahead and tend the table and start a yard sale. Oh, I should mark up the prices. Let's do, let's do 100% and see how that works. Hello, ma'am. Oh, I see you wear earrings. I have some earrings here if you're interested. They're made with diamonds, so diamond earrings. Or we also have this set of diamond blink earrings if you're interested. Let's go ahead and give her a sales pitch. Uh, Level 2 Charisma. Oh, look at that. Oh, he bought the bling diamond earrings. Oh, okay, I guess she decided. Is she going to go in my tent? Probably. Hello, Miss Katrina Caliente. Are you interested in some diamond earrings? I can't tell if you're wearing any, but I think this would go lovely with the necklace you're currently wearing. <laughs> Hello, Miss Bernice. Are you interested in any jewelry? We got some bracelets here, a nice necklace. It doesn't have any gems in it, but I mean, it's so nice design. It's nice and lovely. Also, if anybody is a career person, we've got this beautiful spire shaped emerald that will help you with school and career. Ooh, looks, so, looks, like, so. looks like Miss Bernice <laughs> bought our bracelet ah, that we have here. Have yum. Can you Let's give you another sales pitch. <laughs> oh, We've been here long enough. I think you should have bought something by now. <laughs> hello, hello. Oh, are you back for more, sir? Did you really enjoy those earrings? Did you gift it to somebody? I don't see you wearing them. Let's give you a sales pitch. The selling top is great because it takes up my social. Oh no, bills! How much are our bills gonna be? Oh. One thousand one hundred eighty-five. I mean, we have the simoleons, but I was kind of gonna use that to make 
<laughs> like a box to live in. Oh, oh man. Oh. Okay. There's that. Hello, Miss Landgraf. Oh, oh. Hello, Miss Pearson. Oh, Mr. Oh, Bird Pearson. Are you interested in any jewelry we have here today? Oh, are you are interested in a crystal and emerald? Oh, what was that? What was that? Oh, it was the bracelet. I don't know if people, I don't know if it was Bjorn or Clara, but one of them bought it. I like how they came together and worked together. I think that's so sweet. Limited stock. Get it while it's here. Okay, I have to restart the yard sale because the last one ended. Hi, everybody. Let's tend the table, please. We're so close. Wow, we already have 4,000 simoleons. I was hoping for like 5,000 before I start building our little box to live in. But we also have those bills to pay off. Well, I'm wondering if I should even worry about paying them right now because I don't really have anything else that use electricity. So we'll see, we'll see how the rest of this sells. Hello, sir. Are you interested in some nice diamond earrings? Or maybe an emerald spire shaped gemstone? Oh, no, okay, bye. Oh, you've come yeah. back? Is there something, maybe you want the earrings yeah, now? Yeah. 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 Oh, somebody yeah. bought the gemstone for 230 yeah. smiles. Oh, who are you vibing with? Gina? Oh. Hello, are you interested in some jewelry? Who did that? Was that Beatrice? Oh, who was that? Maybe it was... Maybe it's Bernice. Oh, maybe it was him. By the way, thank you. Thank you for shopping here today. Oh, so here we have the opportunity to get some money. If we choose money, 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 that means we have to marry somebody in order to get the inheritance or we can choose under what conditions still get some money it's a little bit less than what you would get than if you chose the money 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 but like i said we're not going to do spouses so we're going to do under what conditions and we got 2500 simoleons lovely see i marked down the sales price to 25% because this is a botch piece of jewelry and it probably won't sell very well. Would you like some botch jewelry? She would like botch jewelry. Okay, that's it, everybody. We are sold out. Thank you so much for coming today. Let's go ahead and have a quick meal and then we will jump into building our little box. Okay, so now it is time to start decorating. Let me go ahead and put on the move objects cheat. That way we can move all of this around. We're going to keep this. These, oh, I can sell these without getting money. Perfect, because I don't want those. Same with this dirt pile. Get rid of the dirt pile. Clean this place up a little bit. We don't need the sign anymore, but I'm going to put that in my inventory because I don't want to get the money from it. Get rid of this little dirt pile. Go ahead and put this in my inventory as well. We'll keep that out. Move this around a bit. I'm trying to decide if I should flatten this or just leave it as is. Maybe I can use it to my advantage. Maybe. Now, bear with me. I hardly ever do terrain. So, flatten terrain, flatten to height. Flatten, let us say flatten to height, I guess. No. Oh, oh gosh. That um, went a little bit faster than I intended it to. I don't want it to be too big. Let's try this. Let's try the flatten to height. Increase control bracket. Okay. Let's 
let's try this height here. Nothing too high. Let me get rid of that last bit. Oh, I didn't mean to do all of it. Okay, this looks nice. This is like a nice little base. Now we're gonna go ahead. Maybe I should shape this up a little bit. So I'm not very strong at decorating, but we're gonna give it our best. How big is this? Maybe we'll create like a little nook for this to go into. Just like a little one. this down. Hopefully this works even with move objects on. Maybe too I should make like a little... do that. Just to give it some shape. Now this will have to go vertical. Maybe I should go ahead and make it two-story. Let's see. So one of her... here goes storybook. I think I want to lean on the storybook. Let's do this. Okay, so bring that out a little more. Actually, no. What we'll do instead, instead of bringing this out, we'll just create it out a little bit and that way it can be like a shaded Part right here just a little bit we don't need too much then I'll close this off with that open beautiful okay, so here's the shape of our house these are supposed to be tiny houses so we will keep this a little on the smaller side so her color is purple but I don't think that there's any really good like purple stones so what I'm gonna do or purple wallpaper in general I want to do stone but what stone do I want to use and in what color is she like into gothic style I'm thinking maybe this to me this looks like it has some sort of purple to it I could be wrong I could just be Color blind. We'll do this. Here we have our storybook options. This one looks cute. Does anything come in purple? No. So I think what we're probably going to do is like a lot of the accent pieces will have to be purple out here. Like I'll probably bring this tree up to the front. But for now, what? Let's go with this. We'll do a little something here. What should I do? No, I should do a roof there instead. Let's do a roof. Right there, should I pull it out? Maybe I should go ahead and bring this in. Or should I keep it out and put columns there? Definitely gonna have to change the roofing on this. I need them purple. Oh, there are some that are purple. Okay, okay. I can try this. Oh, I like that. Okay. Gotta get some trim. Should I? What is this? Oh, that's not what I thought it was. <laughs> I thought they were like flowers, I guess not. Oh, that's kind of cool. Let's change the color. Probably not that color. So it looks like maybe like a gray. There's the white. Should I do that? Or maybe I should do something else in like a gray. Yeah, I think we'll keep with that. Now let's see what kind of windows we have. Let's start with, we'll 
We'll switch by color with this purple. Ooh. Love that. Let's do this. It's very tall, but I love it. Wow, look at that. Does it come in other colors? Oh, it does. Ooh, that's cool. Oh, I love that too. Hmm, I wonder if we should change it. No, let's let's keep this for now. Let's keep that for now. Also, with our door, we have some purple doors here. None of these doors are really speaking to me. Maybe if we look in the storybook. Oh, okay, okay. How do we feel about this? I feel like it's so off-centered. And maybe I should make it more centered, but I'm not sure. Let's just keep let's just keep messing with it and see how we feel. I like the fox on this door, so we're gonna keep that. Maybe change the color up. I guess we'll keep with the white because it's a black. It's like too much black, so we'll keep with the white. Let's put our roof up here. I'm thinking instead of putting my gemology table here that maybe I'll turn this into like a fireplace or I can put I'll turn it into a fireplace on the second level so they can't keep the this here oops I forgot I had move objects on so I'll keep that there turn this into a fireplace because I think this would be hello I think this would be a good spot for like a chimney let's see are any of these storybook This one is, does it have, it's not really matching, what about, no. I wonder if instead, let's make just a little box here. Color it, let's see about lifting it up. Okay, okay, where are, you, where are you going? Lift it up, out of the shadows. Put that there, how does that look? Um, like it could be better. Honestly, it looks like it could be better. Maybe, maybe that just isn't the chimney for us. So I believe this is the matching, this looks like the matching chimney. It just still looks a little funny. I don't know. I mean, maybe I can keep it, but just like put it somewhere else. And instead, just put like a roof over here. Okay, so we'll scrap, I guess we'll scrap the chimney idea inside the house, which is perfectly fine. It's going to take up a lot of them anyway. So these are some of the storybook windows. That's nice, nice and big. Do we like this one? And it looks like it lines up. Okay, so I just completed the outside of the house. Definitely looking a bit better now. Added a few purple accents in the bushes and this wisteria. This right here, this little bug light, it, it's storybook and purple. So that was like a win. Go around here to the back. I got rid of the. Let's go down camera. 
I got rid of the little outshoot here because I changed the location of where I should probably get. Or maybe I'll just adjust this. Here, let me add some more of these to the back. So I got rid of the offshoot or this little out bit because I did change the position of the stairs. So this is what the outside of this looks like. Definitely could do some more like yardscaping, but we are running out of money and I have yet to add anything to the inside except for, I just added some wallpaper. So let's look at some flooring. Here's the options under storybook. Maybe this would be fun. Let's get rid of that grid. Oh, this is fun. This is nice. Let's take a look at the other colors. Maybe a gray? Is that too much gray going on though? Black? No. I do like this brown. But everything else is gray, so we'll leave it with the gray. Do the same for upstairs, where our bedroom's gonna be. Oh, I should add a railing. I'll use this fence. Put that there. Cute, perfect. It's a little small for a bedroom, but it's only gonna be opal, so it doesn't have to be anything too extravagant. Let's go ahead and find a bed for her. Let's go filter it to storybook. Okay, not many options. Uh, maybe we'll switch it to just purple then. So we have to decide how big of a bed we want. I don't think we're going to be able to go too big, so I think a double might be out of the question. Oh yeah, double is definitely out of the question. So we'll go something that's smaller. Oh, this is cute. I like the little drapes. This is also really pretty. If I wanted drapes, I could always add the ones here from oh wow it's so nice and bright in here from high school years oh wow it makes it really bright in here i love that so i had a little bedside table oh you know what i should look into we should look at the crystal creation items that would be nice do we have a bed no what color should we make this i guess white to match the bed Maybe like that. Get this a little closer. I hate how far away these are. Anything else in the crystal creations? Let's look at everything. Wow, there's so many nice things here. Look at this. I love this. What colors does it have? Oh, pretty. Oh, I feel like it doesn't match the bed now. Maybe I should change the bed. I think I really want this bed, so I got rid of the rug. I'm gonna keep this bed for now. Um, there's some other options, like maybe this Princess Cordelia. I'll take a look out later. I just see it's an eight thousand dollar bed, and we do not have the funds for that. So here's her bed. We have a nice bed. Actually, I wasn't going to sell this, but it's technically hers, so we're gonna sell it. We'll go ahead and put like a little kitchen together. Ooh, if we can. Okay, so these would be her options. Oh, I don't even have 500. I guess we'll go with something cheap for now. Just put in this color. Should I sell the cooler if I have... And just maybe get like a countertop? Oh, those would be cute, huh? Not very many options. Here, at least she has a place to store her food and to prepare some basic meals. So I'm just making some salad here, and I guess everybody's just going to walk in and help themselves. But wow, I wasn't expecting to actually have like essentially a full house. I was expect I was just expecting a box, but we did so well on ourselves with our jewelry. So, in the next video, we're going to see what we can do about the community center, since I haven't really added much. I mean, technically I added 
it says dumpster and a shower but yeah so that would be it for today's video where's opal oh okay well i guess opal's going to sleep so that will be it for today's video i hope everybody enjoyed leave a like comment and i'll see you in the next video bye bye